So good morning, Mrs. Cruz. Good morning. So today you are here uh, approximately five years after your surgery. And so when you originally came to me, I actually remember your story very well. You were wearing mm -hmm. very big, heavy braces. Yes, for at least four years before I saw you. Okay. Mm -hmm. And you were told that there was absolutely nothing that could be done about your condition and that you would have to wear those ugly braces for the rest of your life in your shoes. Yes. And then I said, oh, no, we can do something about it. Yes, yes, yes. You, you can dance, right? Yes, I can. And now you I dance, can. what, two dances? Yes, I can that? definitely okay. two dances. I can walk. I don't have braces. I can look like a girl and put shoes on for my dances. And Good. I just have to be careful. So you had a pretty extensive surgery done, actually yes. probably one of the most complicated surgeries we do in lower extremities that is called triple arthrodesis. Mm -hmm where we fused three different joints in your foot and ankle. And uh, remember that you were in a wheelchair for six weeks yeah, after yes. each surgery. Yes. And we did it one year apart. Yes. Okay. Yes. And then we did your husband's in between. Yes. Okay. <laughs> and uh, basically, you know, a lot of people are contemplating because they say, well, six weeks is a very, very long time. But I think in a big scheme of things, six weeks is really a short time comparison to great outcomes that we can get. Don't you agree oh, with that? Oh, yes. I willingly had the second one after the first one. Right. It, it was great. Uh, so for somebody mm -hmm. who is thinking whether they should or should not have it done, would you highly recommend this surgery? I certainly would. Okay. Yes, I will. It's and you would only refer, it, refer them to us, <laughs> right? Yes, I would. <laughs> Dr. Wellens is my angel. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much for sharing it yeah, with us.